Compass Haitian Creole, compa, or compa, is a dance music and modern meringue in Haiti with African roots. The genre was popularized following the 1955 creation of the band Conjuncta International by Namours Jean-Baptiste. Compass is the main music of many countries such as Dominica and the French Antilles, etc. Whether it is called Zouk where French Antilles artists of Martinique and Guadeloupe have taken it or Compass in places where Haitian artists have toured, this meringue style is very influential in the Caribbean, Africa, Cape Verde, Portugal, France, part of Canada, South and North America. Etymology and characteristics Compass is short for Compass Direct in French. In Creole, it is spelled as compa, compa diric or simply compa. It is commonly spelled as it is pronounced as compa, the word compass in Spanish means beat or rhythm. And one of the most distinctive characteristics of compass is the consistent pulsating beat tambu, a trait common to many styles of Caribbean music. Compass direct, literally means direct beat. Topic history Namours Jean-Baptiste presented his Ensemble aux Calabasas in 1955, named after the club aux Calabasas, located at Carrefour, a western neighborhood of Port-au-Prince, Haiti's capital where the band used to perform on weekends. Compass popularity took off likely due to the genre's ability to improvise and hold the rhythm section steady. Jean-Baptiste incorporated a lot of brass and easily recognized rhythms. Compass is sung in Creole, English, Spanish, French, Portuguese, etc. Namor's popularity grew in and out of the country. Its clean horn section was remarkable and the band featured meringue tunes that gained instant popularity. For example, in Martinique, several music groups, Ensemble Abricot Bienvenue, Festival Compass, Les Jubaps Isabelle, Combo Jazz Electronic Compass, Par Gadam Sukot, Georges Plonquit Vinny Dance Compass Direct, etc. have all within a year conquered the public with the many tunes or compositions of Namor's. Later Namor's became a favorite of Dominican president, Joaquin Balaga who often contracted the band. This is why hits like T. Carol, Chagrin de Moore, featured by known Dominican stars Luis Miguel and others are also sung in Spanish. In the late 1950s Namors and the Sicket brothers from Haiti would frequently tour the Caribbean, especially Curacao, Aruba, St. Lucia, Dominica and mostly the French islands of Martinique and Guadeloupe to spread the seed of the meringue cadence or compass. Webert Sickert, the originator of Cadence recorded three LPs albums with French Antilles producers, two with Cellini Discs in Guadeloupe and one with Balthazar in Martinique. Haitian Compass or Cadence bands were asked to integrate Antillean musicians. Consequently, the leading Les Guise Troubadours, with influential singer Louis Lehens, along other bands, played a very important role in the schooling of Antillians to the Meringue Compass or Cadence music style. Almost all existing Haitian Compass bands have toured these islands that have since adopted the music and the dance of the Meringue. Topic. Dance style The dance style that accompanied Compa Dirac in the 1950s, was a two-step dance called Care Square. As a meringue, a ballroom dance, Compass is danced in pairs. Sometimes partners dance holding each other tightly and romantically, in this case often most of the moves are made at the hips. Topic. Mini jazz or small bands During and after the U.S. occupation, the word jazz has become synonymous with music bands in Haiti. So the mini jazz is a reduced meringue compass band. The movement started in the mid-1960s when young small neighborhood bands played compa featuring paired electric guitars, electric bass, drum set conga cowbell, some use an alto sax or a full horn section, others use a keyboard, accordion This trend, launched by Shalou Shalou after 1965, came to include a number of groups from Port-au-Prince neighborhoods, especially the suburb of Pechenville. Les Corvington, Taboo Combo, Les Difficiles, Les Loops Noirs, Les Frères Dijon, Les Fantaisistes de Carrefour, Bossa Combo and Les Ambassadeurs among others, formed the core of this middle-class popular music movement. From 1968 to the 1970s prominent bands like Bossa Combo, Volo Volo de Boston, Les Chalou Chalou, Les Ambassadeurs, Les Vikings, Les Fantaisistes, Les Loops Noirs, Les Frères Dijon, Les Difficiles, Les Gypsies and mostly the Majestic Taboo Combo have exerted a dominance on the Caribbean and many places in Europe and South America musical scene. For example, Taboo Combo has remained on the Paris hit parade for weeks with its New York City hit. Taboo did fill New York Central Park in the same period. These young musicians were critical in the creation of new techniques that contribute to the fanciness of the style. Although Raymond Guispard had already started it in the 1950s, however, guitar players such as Michel Corvington, Les Corvington, Robert Martineau, Les Difficiles, Gypsies, Scorpio, Topless, 
Dadu Pascat, Taboo Combo, Magnum Band, Jean Claude Jean, Taboo Combo, Superstar. Serge Rosenthal, Shalou Shalou, Hans Felix, Les Ambassadeurs, Volo Volo de Boston, Ricardo, Tiplum, Les Ambassadeurs, Claude Marcelin, Les Difficiles, DP Express, Zekel, Police Nozil, Les Frères Dejon, DP Express, and many more have created intricate, mostly rhythmic guitar styles that constitute a strong distinguishable feature of the meringue. Topic: Meringue compass or cadence and its derivatives. The meringue compass, deeply rooted in many countries, has been a strong influence and even called other names, some examples are Zouk, Coladira, Kazomba, Cadence Lipso. Zouk Zouk was a brief experiment, an attempt to develop a proper local music that should lessen or even eradicate the meringue cadence or compass influence from the French Antilles. When the MIDI technology came out, Cassiv used it fully, creating new sound in both their fast Zouk Baton and Compa. The Antillians were all over with Zouk but as other bands from the Caribbean and Africa added the MIDI technology to their music, people got used to it. Because it was a jump-up beat, the fast Zouk Baton faded away, and Antillians continued to play and dance meringue cadence or compass. Topic Coladira There is a strong compass influence in Cape Verdean music. During the 1960s to 1980s Haitian artists and bands such as Claudette and T. Pierre, Taboo Combo and mostly Gesner Henry alias Coupe Clower and the Dominican group Exile One were very popular in Africa. In addition, the French Antilles Cassive and other French Antillian musicians, whose main music is Compass, toured Cabo Island on various occasions. Many Cape Verdean artists feature Compass. Talented Tito Paris Danka Mami Criola is a good example. This CD featured music close to Haiti Taboo Combo, Caribbean Sextet, Tropicana, and French Antilles Cassive, etc. Cape Verdean's artists have been exposed to Compa in the US and France. Today the new generation of Cape Verdean artists features a light compass close to Haitian and French Antillian. Until Haitian musicians could tour Cabo Verde, the title compass promoted as Zouk by French Antillian artists would not be popular. <laughs> Cadence Lipso Webert Sickert, the originator of Cadence known for his great virtuosity, mostly harmonic skills, was well appreciated in the Caribbean. This is why the term cadence was more popular than compass. Cadence lipso is the Dominican cadence. Cadence and calypso were the two dominant styles in Dominica hence the name cadence lipso. The great majority of the songs are either calypso, reggae and mostly cadence or compass. If there is any fusion it should not be significant enough to be listed on album or CD covers. Finally cadence lipso is danced the same way as compass. Originally the word cadence or cadence was on album covers, whether Grammix or Exile One. They featured calypso, reggae and mostly cadence, gramix, mediba, cadans, banana, sweet cadans, our par bon, cadans, our pitot, cadans, reggae down, disco live, cadans. This same tune is categorized as Zouk Retro by DJ Zach. Midlay Cadans November 24, 2011, Exile 1, Akiaka, Gade Day. Midnight, Get Ready 1997, etc. Exile 1, the leader of the word cadence lipso, featured some reggae, calypso and mostly cadence music. For example, album. Exile 1, Gordon Henderson 40 Vol. 1. Features 14 cadans out of 18 tunes. 1. Rosita 2, Bar Yo Boy 3. Jumbolo 4. Jamais Voir C.A. Calypso Tune 5, Reflection 6. Anom Car Batter Anom 7. Gades Day 8, R Ta Ta 9. ICO Vol. 10. Pompilili 11. Aki Yaka 12, Bavon Les Vacances O Antilles Calypso Tune 13. Ilan Calypso Tune 14. Naus Travel Po A 15, Cadence Lipso 16, Sexile 17, Come Here, Reggae Tune 18. Interlude. The song Cadence Lipso is a cadence tune. A third album, Collector Cadence Lipso, features 12 meringue cadence tunes. The album also features tunes from other cadence bands, too. Rigreet, Midnight Groover, Serpent La, C Top 6, La V Vini Plus Raid, Bells Combo 9. Coquette Perroquet, Liquid Ice 12, Mwen Die Au Fay, Black Affairs 7. Chanson de Morophilia Exile 1. It is not sure whether the band's intent was to fusion Trinidadian Calypso with Haitian Cadence or Compass since little was done. The song, La Dominique, in the album, Exile 1 Old School Session, could be an attempt, however, not often repeated. The band music repertoire is mostly Cadence or Compass with all the features of the style, the album, 
Exile One Old School Session, Gree, Vert. Features mostly meringue cadence or compass, six out of eight tunes. One Fate Commune Two Torti Three Family Creole Four Delo Five Sauvez Riviere La and Seven Sylvie Of course, the band had its personality. It was a great Cadans band. In the early 1970s, the full horn section Cadans band Exile One, led by the talented Gordon Henderson, was the first to use the synthesizers to their music that other young Cadence or Compass bands from Haiti, mini jazz, and the French Antilles emulated in the 1970s. Exile One toured many places with Kadan's music, Japan, the Indian Ocean, Africa, North America, Europe, the Cape Verde Islands. Other Dominica Cadence bands included the Grammics. Review Exile One CD 40 Anniversary, Grammic Collection 74-76 and others available at Amazon Music, Black Roots, Black Machine, Naked Feet, Bell's Combo, Mantra, Black Affairs, Liquid Ice, Wafrakai, Midnighter Groovers and Milestone, while the most famous singers included Bill Thomas, Chubby Mark, Gordon Henderson, Linford John, Janet Azuz, Sinky Rabus, Tony Valmond, Jeff Joseph, Mike Moreau and Anthony Gussie. Ophelia Marie is a popular singer of Cadence in the 1980s. Topic. Soccer In the 1970s with the frequent tours of the Sickert Brothers, Exile One, and so many meringue bands, Compass or Cadence Rampa has become very influential in several parts of the world, specifically the Caribbean. Its influence on the Calypso gave rise to soccer, closer to Cadence or Compass, 16. The Calypsonian Lord Shorty of Trinidad was the first to really define his music and with Indrani in 1973 and Endless Vibration. Not just the song but the entire album in 1975, Calypso music really took off in another direction. Later in 1975 Lord Shorty visited his good friend Maestro in Dominica where he stayed at Maestro's house for a month while they visited and worked with local Cadence or Compass artists. You had Maestro experimenting with Calypso and Cadence. Sadly a year later Maestro would die in an accident in Dominica and his loss was palpably felt by Shorty, who penned, Higher World, as a tribute. In Dominica, Shorty had attended an Exile One performance of Kadans, and collaborated with Dominica's 1969 Calypso King, Lord Tokyo and two Calypso lyricists, Chris Serafine and Pat Aaron in the early 1970s, who wrote him some Creole lyrics. Soon after Shorty released a song, Our Petty, with words like, Our de moin our petty Shorty, meaning, You told me you are small Shorty. Soccer's development includes Calypso, Cadence, Compass, and Indian musical instruments, particularly the Dolak, Tabla and Dantal, as demonstrated in Shorty's classic compositions, Indrani, and Shanti Om. <laughs> Kazomba Kazomba is a popular music from Angola. It is a derivative of traditional Angolan semba with the French Antilles compass. Although most music came from Africa, Angola has been receiving Haitian influence for years. For instance, great meringue queen Haitian Martha Jean Claude lent her voice and music to the Angolan Revolution. She came with the Cuban troops. 20. During the 70s, Haitian bands and artists such as Coupe Clower, Tabu Combo, Bossa Combo, DP Express, and Dominican bands like Exile One and Gramix were popular in Africa. After many Cape Verdean emigrants arrived in France where they were exposed to compass music in the 80s, they mixed it with a traditional Cape Verde style, the Coladera, creating the Cabo Love, which is very similar to Kazomba and typically sung in Cape Verdean Creole. It is this rhythm that was confused with Kazomba, and was heard in Portugal when Eduardo Paim arrived there and released his first record with Kazomba music. During the 80s to 90s, French Antilles Cassive has toured the country with its compass, leaving influence. Lately, Kazomba has been close to French Antilles and Cape Verdean light compass and sung generally in Portuguese. No wonder why Kazomba shows that strong similarity with Meringue Compass. 21. Topic. Notable compass bands and artists See also Cadence Rampa Cadence Lipso Caribbean Music Haitian Carnival Meringue Zouk